to watch a magic show. I love magic shows and... But wait, where's Mr. Carl? He said, we're here for a magic show. Mr. Carl? Mr. Carl, where are you, Mr. Carl? Hanif! Hanif, I'm trapped inside the hat, Hanif. Please help me. Wait, you're trapped inside the hat? How come? Hanif, don't waste time. Just tap three times on the hat to release me. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Let me get the hat. And we're going to tap the hat. And one, two, and release three. Where are you, Mr. Carl? Hanif, I said tap three times on the hat, not in the hat. On the hat. Okay, okay, okay. Let's put it here. We're going to tap three times on the hat. And one, and two, and release three. Wow. Yes, finally. You have been released. <gasps> Abracadabra! Now you are watching d -Date TV KPM in the level 1 slot and we are going to learn together English, definitely. And my name is Hanif Sean. I'm your host. I'm also a magician today. How interesting. And of course, you have just watched our teacher's profile and with me is Mr. Haikal. Hello. Hello, Mr. Haikal. I'm, uh, you prefer to be addressed as Mr. Carl, right? Up to you. Yes. Yeah. So what kind of magic do you like, Mr. Carl? What? kind of magic? Huh. Harry Potter's magic. Oh, oh, that's interesting, definitely. And Mr. Carl, you know what? It's not just the two of us today. We also have our sign language interpreter, which is Teacher Ida. Hello, Teacher Ida. How are you? Teacher Ida is feeling healthy as well. Teacher Ida, I have a question for you. Do you like to watch magic shows? Oh, yes. Mm. So she said, yes, she definitely loves to watch magic shows. And it's going to be a very interesting and magical session today, Indeed. Mr. Carl. And we have four pupils joining us online and to appear. <laughs> oh, pupils. There Hello, yes. pupils. Wave at us. Wave at us. Yes, Mr. Carl, may we yep. have you to introduce our four pupils online? My pleasure. All right. Hello, everyone. I'm Mr. Carl. And today we have got four pupils in the Google Meet. And the first one is Muhammad Adidayan bin Muhammad Faisal from SK, Saujana Utama, Kuala Selangor. Hello, Adi. Hello, Adi. All right. With his gorgeous mom there. And next up, we have got no Imran bin Muhammad Shahirat from SK Station 1 Bandar Kinrara. Hello No. Hi No. And next, Hanif, we have got Adelia Nuha binti Abdul Halim from Sri Hufas Saujana Utama. Hello Nuha. Hi Nuha. Hey. And last but not least, we have got Zahira Aina binti Muhammad Zubair all the way from Sekolah Kebangsaan Bandar Baru, Kuala Selangor. Hello. Hello. Hi, Aina. All right. So, Mr. Carl. Yep. Shall we start the lesson? Our, our sure. amazingly magical lesson today. I'm excited. What are we going to learn? Okay, Hanif. And our pupils and our students at home. So, today's topic is... Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? All right, with our year one pupils. So we are going to look at, first thing first, the learning standards for today's lesson is 1.1.2. Understand with support, specific information and details of very simple phrases and sentences. And next one is 4.3.2. We hope that our pupils will be able to spell familiar high-frequency words correctly. Shall I move on, Hanif? Yes, please. I think there's a lot that All we need to cover. Right. True. So, our learning objectives for today, the first one, our pupils are going to listen to the descriptions and choose the correct pictures. And next one, they are going to write simple sentences using prepositions correctly. 
All right, so what do we have next, Mr. Carl? All right, honey, if MP pupils at home and also in Google Meet, so I'm going to explain the usage of in, on, and under. So let's take a look at the example here. So we have uh, two objects here. We have first a table and also mm. a frog. Mm -hmm. All right, so I'm going to use the table and so the frog to help our pupils to understand the usage of those three prepositions. All right, let's move to the first one. Let's take a look at the frog. Where is it? So now the frog is actually on the table. Look at the position of the frog. It is on the table. Okay, next. Where is the frog? The frog is in the drawer. Okay, at the table, there is a drawer. And the, tro the, the frog now is hiding in the drawer. And last but not least, the third preposition. Let's take a look at the picture. The frog is under the table. The frog is under the table. Okay, so Hanif, hmm. I think we shall proceed to our first activity. We have an activity right now, yeah. sure. A listening activity and with me, I've got five coloured envelopes. Very nice. All right. So our pupils are going to listen to the description inside the envelope and they're going to look at the picture. There are five pictures over here and try to find the picture that match the description inside the envelope. Okay. I so, guess you shall start first, Hanif, all to right. help our pupils to understand the activity. Okay, so I'm supposed to choose my yeah. favourite colour now. I see right. yellow, blue, orange, green and red and definitely I love the colour yellow. Oh. So I'm going to pick this one, Mr. Carr. Alright, I'm going to read the dis description, Hanif. Please listen attentively. Okay, let's listen carefully, everyone. Okay, the cat is on the book. The cat is on the book. So take a look, Hanif. Picture A, B, C, D and E. The cat is on the, the book. The cat is on the book. I Which one? see a cat in picture E there and I believe that's a book and the cat is on the book. Got it right. Yeah. So picture E. Picture E. Yeah. The cat is on the book. book. Okay. So let's see our pupils in the Google Meet. I guess we shall give them a chance to try. Yes. So let's start with Adi. Hi, Adi. Hi. Pick one colour here. I've got blue, orange, green and red. Uh, which is your favourite colour, Adi? Uh, blue. 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 Maybe Good choice. If you want to read the description for sure. Adi. Okay, Adi, listen carefully, listen yeah. attentively, everyone as well. Please Even read twice. At home. I will read this twice and it says the frog is in the bag. Hmm. Hmm. The frog is in the bag. Which one, Adi? Picture A, B, C or picture D? C. Picture C. The frog is in the bag. Is in the bag. So Adi thought that is picture C. What hmm. do you think, honey? What do I think? Well, there's a frog, there's a bag, mm -hmm. but the frog, I think, is on the bag? Yeah, it's on the bag and it should be Adi. Which one, Adi, do you think? Is it A or C? Uh, A. Well done, Adi. The frog is in the bag. You can see the frog there in the bag. <laughs> so we shall reward Adi with a star. Good. Okay, next, sure. let's proceed with Adi. No, no. Could you please choose one envelope? What is your favorite color, oh. no? No, one envelope. Orange, oh. red or green. We can't hear you. Red. Oh, red. Okay, red. Okay, I'm going to read you the description. All right, Adi, no. The rat is on the desk. The rat is on the desk. Which one? 
picture B, C or D. The D. right. Come again. D. D. Picture well D. Well done. Wow. The red is on the desk. Next, let's hear from Adik Nuha. Adik Nuha, two options here. Orange or green? Green. 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 Good choice. All right, Adik Nuha. Listen carefully. The frog is on the back. The frog is on the back. Is it B or is it C, Nuha? What is your answer? What's your answer, Nuha? Picture B or picture C? The frog is on the back. C. Picture C. Well, well done. done. Another star for Adik Nuha. So we gave a star for All Adik right. Nuha. So I now you don't have any choice. I'm going to read you the description from the orange envelope. So Adik Aina, the rat is under the desk. The rat is under the desk. It's pretty obvious, right, Hanif? It is. But we need to give a chance to Aina to say something, Aina. So which picture, Aina? Picture B. Yes. Brilliant. It's very glaring there, picture B. And you can see the rat is there, under the desk. And do we give a star to Aina as well? Obviously, honey. Wow. So that's all for our first listening activity. Great. So everyone gets a star. I might want to get a star as well later, but we're going to take a short break. If you want more stars, do not go anywhere. Continue to stay tuned with us on DDA TV KPM. The bluebird is blank the table. A on, B under, C in. Yes, you've got it right. The answer is B under. The bluebird is under the table. KPM. Hello everyone, you are watching DDAT TV KPM and we are now in slot level one and we're learning English together. And of course with me is Mr. Carl and it's a very interesting topic that we're learning together today, Mr. Carl. Yep. It's about where is it? Where is it? Hmm. Where and is we it? are using the three prepositions in, on and under. Alright, so in today's lesson, we are playing with those three prepositions. Hanif, let's proceed with the second activity. Sure, let's start. Alright, pupils in Google Meet and also at home, we are going to try to write simple sentences using in, on and under. But before that, I'm going to explain again on the usage of in, on and under. So let's go with the first one. Take a look at this picture. Hmm. So, we're talking about the frog. Where is it? Where is the frog? Where is Mr. Froggy? Hmm. Mr. So, Froggy is... It's on the table. So, you can see here, the frog is resting on the table. Something on something, we call it as on. Alright? The frog is on the table, or you can also say it's on the table. Next one, Hanif. Hmm. Look at this picture. Where hmm. is Mr. Frog? Here? Yes, where is it? So, now, the frog is under the table. It's under the table. Got it, children? I'm sure they do. And our yeah. pupils online as well. And last picture. Fantastic, so Hanif. All right. Now? Last but not least, where is it? Where is the frog? So, take a look at the picture. So, it's... <laughs> In the drawer. It's in the drawer. Alright? I guess they are clear. If you are good to go, pupils, could you please show me thumbs up? Let's please. have a look at all your thumbs show up Show to the there. camera. Adi 
Aina yes. Nuha Aina. Okay, well oh. done. So let's proceed. And I've told our pupils to get ready with their mini whiteboard and also marker. Do you have it with you? Have Good you job. So let's try to write simple sentences using in, on, and under. Okay, take a look at the first one. Hmm. Where is the cat? You have got a cat and also a book in the picture. So come on, try to construct a simple sentence for this picture. Huh, where is the cat? Kay. So are you pupils, are you ready? Pupils online or friends at home? Are you writing yeah. as well? I'm sure they are writing as well, Mr. Carl. Yes. Well done. Very good. Okay, keep on trying. Yes. And is it uh, on, in, or under? Hmm. What I'm do not you sure. Think? Let's see our pupils' answers. If you're ready, yeah. can we get them to show their answers? Or would you like to pick one, Mr. Carl? Let everyone show their mini bot. Exactly. Mini -bot first. Okay. So whoever's ready, please leave your mini bots up to the camera. Yeah, and show it to us. Come on. Pupils. So all of us have a look. Ha, okay. Ha, ha. So Adi is ready and we see Nuha is there. Nuha is ready. Aina. Aina is ready. And we have one more. Okay, it's see. okay. Maybe we can have Adi first to read his answer. Okay, Adi. Tell us, where is the cat, Adi? It's on the book. It's on the book. Yes, you got it right. The cat is on the book. Or you can also use it, right? Okay, the pronoun for animal, cat. So it's on the book. Hanif, yeah. reward him with a star. And well we're done, giving a Adi. Star for Adi. And no, no seems to already be. He's also ready with his answer. Okay, no, also... show us, no, show us. Your mini whiteboard. We have seen everyone's answers. Yeah. The cat is on yeah. the book. Well done, everyone. Well done. Okay, let's proceed with the second picture. Take a look at this picture. And now, pupils, where is the cat? <coughs> there is a cat and also a desk. So where is it now? Hmm. Mr. Carl, mm. while they are writing the answers, yeah. Do we give them rewards for their first answer? Or we have more later? Yeah, we have more later, honey. More later, okay. But hold you want to catch on. more stars here. True. While we, while we wait for them to get ready for the stars, see our pupils at home as well. Are you writing down your answers? And where is the cat? Hmm. hmm. Where is table. the cat now? There's a table and there's a cat. So anyone done with your answer, you can show to the camera. Hold yeah. your mini whiteboard. Uh, okay. Oh answer. no, no. The first one to finish writing the sentence. Okay, no. Read aloud your sentence to us. Okay, no. The cat is under the desk. The cat is under the desk. Hmm. Perfect. Wonderful. Well done, no, well done, Adi. I can see well done, Nuha. And Aina is still trying. It's okay. All right, so you have got it right. The cat is under the desk. Let's proceed with the third picture. Okay. One star for no. One star for no All coming right. up. Next one. Look at the picture. There is a lizard and a bat. Hmm. A lizard and a school bag or a bag. Okay, come on, children. Come on, pupils. In the Google Meet, also at home, try to construct the sentence for this picture. Hmm. Where is the lizard? Where is the lizard? Oh. On, in, under. Well, Mr. Carl, I don't like lizards. Why? So wherever it is, I don't like it. <laughs> I don't like it. But we'll see whether our pupils have their answers ready. Honey, if there's a lizard. Oh no! Oh! Okay. Mm. All right. Uh. Anyone? Uh. Yes, Nuha. 
Nuha uh, is the first one to show to the camera. Okay, Nuha, please read your sentence to us. Okay, Nuha. The lizard is on the back. The lizard is on the back. 100%. Correct. Well done. Well I don't, done, I don't, I don't want any lizard on my back, Mr. Okay. Ka. But Nuha gets a star for, for that, that answer. That's and yes. here we have our next question. Is that our last question? Yep. Then the last one. Take a look at this picture. You could see a snake and a pencil case. Come on. A snake and a pencil case. I think, honey, we shall give chance to Aina. Maybe Aina, you just tell us. Aina, you just tell us where is the snake now? Yes, Aina, where is the snake? Aina, okay, Aina, turn on your microphone and tell us, Aina. Just look at the picture and tell us where is the snake? Is it in, on, or under the pencil case? Hmm. What is the pencil case, sir? Huh? Okay, Aina, read your answer, Aina. Uh, you will need to turn on your mic, Aina. Okay, ah, okay. there you go. Oh, nice. Okay, Aina. Oh, tak apa. Dia macam... Aina macam... That appears to be the previous question. Oh, that's the previous one. It's okay. Yes. Oh, anyone? Okay, so we have... No, no. All right, no. Read your answer, no. The snake. The snake? The snake is in the pencil case. The snake is in the pencil case. Well done. And I guess, honey, we just give all the pupils a star Everyone each. gets a star. Yeah. Well done. Well done. Yeah, that seems wow. busy writing, thinking on the best prepositions to match their pictures. Right. And now we're going to take a short break. <sighs> Do not go anywhere because there's so much more. Our magician, Mr. Carl, will be sharing with us on Didate TV, KPM. Do not go anywhere. The yellow bird is blank the table. A on, B under, C in. Yes, you've got it right. The answer is A on. The yellow bird is on the table. KPM. Hello everyone, you're now watching DDAT TV KPM on the level 1 slot and together we are learning English, of course our favourite subject and with me is Mr. Carl, who's wearing a magician's hat. But I'm uh, not a magician. You're not, you're not a magician I'm yet. I'm retiring already. Yeah. So what <laughs> magical uh, things that we're going to learn in this segment now? The magical things. So I asked the pupils to get ready with their textbook and also a pencil. Could you please show to the camera your textbook and also your pencil, pupils? So okay, so they are yeah. good to go. So now, Hanif, since we are learning the three prepositions in, on and under. So I'm going to give a description and using the textbook and pencil, they have to arrange both objects. Okay, are you ready pupils? Show me a thumbs up. Come on, pupils, if you're ready, show me a thumbs up. Yes, so we get a thumbs up. Oh, wonderful. And everyone's giving a thumbs up there. Okay, there they are ready. They are super ready, Hanif. Super ready. So, listen to the first instruction. Mm -hmm. Put your pencil on the textbook. Put your pencil on the textbook. Come on, show to us. Pencil on the textbook. Is, is that right? Yes. Mr. Carl? Yeah. And, and Nuha. Nuha. Yes, ah. so well done. Her textbook magically floated. Yeah. I like that trick, Nuha. Huh? Lot of magical things happening today. <laughs> All right, well done, children. Next one, pupils. Listen carefully. Put the pencil in the textbook. Put the pencil in the textbook. 
Ah. Let's see. And pupils at home as well. Make sure you are also doing this activity yes. together. So everyone get it right, Mr. Carl? All of them know wonderful. Are you wonderful? I know wonderful. And also Nuha. Good job. So they are putting the pencil. Imagine this is a pencil. Yes. In the textbook. textbook. Well done. And the last one. Hmm. Listen carefully. Mm -hmm. Put the pencil under the textbook. Put the pencil under the textbook. Come hey, on, children. Let's do that very quickly. And you are the floating textbook there. Yes. And yeah. the pencil. Yep. It's. It is under the text. Wonderful, book. wonderful. And Mr. Carl, can we get a summary of what we have learned together today? So basically today we are focusing on the three prepositions in, on and under. Alright, and as you could see uh, Hanif, in our lessons today we have a few activities and the pupils are amazingly participated in all the activities. Yes, yeah, so how did they perform overall today? I have more stars to give here. Should I give them they stars? They are fantastic, so just reward them with another star. Wonderful. Well done, Adi. Well done, No. Well done, Nuha. And also, Aina. Please, tap, tap on your shoulder. Tap, One, tap. two, go. <laughs> tap, tap on your shoulder. Wonderful. And each of you get three stars. And Mr. Carl, mm -hmm. our pupils at home, our pupils online as well, they're very hungry for more magical information and knowledge. Where can they get this magical knowledge? For more magical materials, uh -huh. you can access to Sumberku KPM. There you go. And you can see the link there. Proof. Magically <laughs> appearing on your screen. So make sure you go on that link and check out. There's so many, yep. so, there are so many things to learn there. And with that, of course, I would like to thank our teacher today, Mr. Haikal. Thank you so much, Mr. Haikal. I think we had a very wonderful lesson. Me too. And, and definitely our sign language interpreter, uh, teacher Ida as well. And thank you so much, teacher Ida. And of course, to our four pupils online, all of you are fun. Fantastic. True. Wonderful to each and every one of you and our pupils at home. Well done. Continue learning on Didate TV KPM. I'm sure all of you are super excited. So continue to stay tuned with Didate TV KPM. Right before we end, we have a bit of a song. A magical song. A magical song, okay? So we hope to see you again and let's sing along together. I have a box and I have a ball. Yep. Let's sing along. Let's sing along. You are familiar to the tune of this song. Ready? I put the ball on, on, on the big box I put the ball under, under, under the big box <laughs> I put the ball in, in, in the big box Now, Harif, I take the ball from, from, from the big box One more time! One more time, let's do it! Everyone at home, come on! I put the ball on, on, on the big box I put the ball under, under, under the big box I put the ball in, in, in the big box I take the ball from, from, from the big box